The most common problem with Microsoft Store is it doesn't open sometimes, and it shows you the message Microsoft Store not working. In this video, you will know how to fix Microsoft Store not working on Windows 10. Before we start the video, please hit the subscribe button, click the like, and check the bell notification to receive all our news. Without delays, let's start. Today, I'm gonna show you 6 methods to fix the problem, so make sure to complete the video to the end. The first method, changing the region in the language setting. Sometimes Microsoft Store won't open because the region in the language setting aren't configured correctly. To solve this problem, go to the search bar on Windows in the right region and go to region settings. After that, please check your country. So if you live in India, check India. If you live in Brazil, check Brazil. If you live in the United States, check United States. Then you go into change also current formats. Uh, recommended English United States. You will change it to your country again. Then go to language also and here you will change your language so if your language is france you should check france for me my language is english so change the language to the right language of your country nice then go to windows icon here and go to restart your computer and check if windows store is opening if not then move to the next method the second method is ws reset so, what is WS Reset? WS Reset help you to reset with the Windows Store by clearing all the cache and other settings on your PC. So, how we can do that? Go again to the search bar, then search for WS Reset. Then click on WS Reset and it will open a command tab. Then we're going to wait it a little bit. So as you can see here, the Microsoft Store open automatically. You hear? Maybe your problem is solved. To be sure, close this tab, go to the windows and restart your PC again. And if the problem is solved, congratulations. But if not, we will move to the method number three. The method number three is reset Microsoft Store using settings. How we can do that? It's really simple. We'll go to settings, then we will go to to settings from the windows icon here then check the apps option then search this list what you're gonna type here is Microsoft Store micro Microsoft Store then it will uh, then it will show you this Microsoft Store you will go to advanced option, click on Microsoft Store and go to advanced option. Then scroll down and here you will find the reset. In this apps, if this app isn't working right, reset it. The app's data will be deleted. So make sure you don't have any data in your uh, Microsoft Store. If not, click reset, then click reset then wait some seconds or maybe minutes or maybe hours <laughs> then everything is okay then everything is okay go to windows again go to this and and restart windows again and and if this problem solved, so it's okay. If not, we will move to the method number four. Method number four is reinstalling Microsoft Store using PowerShell. If you want to reinstall the Microsoft Store, you need to open your PowerShell. How you can do that? You will go to Windows. 
you will go to this start icon or windows icon and click on the right side of your mouse it will open uh, these things and go to windows powershell admin then uh, check yes it will appear uh, then what you're gonna do now is you will find a link in the description click in the link in the link in the description and it will redirect you to this my website please hit yes i want to receive uh, our news don't forget to click yes i want then click allow notification then uh, scroll down scroll down if you want to read these things these useful things really you're gonna find something useful here uh, and here you will find this line copy this line right there and paste it like that click enter and wait a lot of it now what we want to do is we want to reinstall your microsoft store like we want to uninstall it and reinstall it yeah what you're gonna do right now is you will select this start and search for notepad when you will find notepad you will go again to my website in the link in the description you will find the link in the description and copy this one and you will copy this like that copy go to notepad and paste like that you will paste this one here then return to your power shield and then then right click on the header like that go to edit and go to find then what you will write here you will find what you will write here you will find the microsoft that windows store you will copy it again in my website on the link in the description go to the power shield and paste it here like that and then click find text again find text until you find the package full name as you can see here i found the package full name click cancel and copy this package full name okay when you find the package full name copy this one at the end and go to your notepad and here you will find package full name you will re you will replace what we already copied here you will paste what, what we already copied so you will pass Control v then everything is okay here then now the final step is you will uh, control a to select everything here control c to copy it and go to the bottom of your powershell here and control v paste where you where we copied in the notepad in the notepad and click okay then uh, the progress is started great everything is okay here microsoft store is reinstalled everything is okay now what you're gonna do is console this and this and go to the start windows and turn on your pc turn off it and turn on it restart your pc then the problem will fix inshallah if it not fixed we will move to the next fix the number five method is we will use PowerShell to reinstall all applications, not just Microsoft Store. We will reinstall all application. So how we can do that is we will go again to start the right. Click right on your mouse and go to Windows PowerShell admin again. Click yes. again go to the link in the description and scroll down scroll down until you find the method 5 and copy this line here copy this command line here go to your power shield paste it hit ok wait a lot of it and great it will take some time so wait wait for it please maybe it will show you some errors just ignore these errors it's just some troubleshooting just ignore it and just complete the activation and the reinstalling of the application so
so I will not wait for the reinstalling but you you will wait until everything is finished then uh, when everything is finished go to start go to this go to this power and click restart your computer and everything will be okay so if this fix method not work with you we will pass to the last method so the last method is troubleshooting what we're going to do is we will go to troubleshoot settings then we will scroll down until we find the windows store application and we will go to run the troubleshooter now your PC is searching for the troubleshoot that maybe you face in your case. So the windows will suggest for you some trouble troubleshooting and you will and you will follow every step windows suggest you and thank you for your time. Please hit the subscribe button, hit the like, the bell notification. We'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.